All right. Hello. It's time for another uh, another weird game. This one's not quite as old as the uh, not not as old as the D as the DOS Shockwave game stream. That was I think that was the last kind of weird thing I did last. But uh, I'm gonna start things off with an obscure old roller coaster PC game today. We'll probably get maybe an hour, a little less out of that. And then I'm going to do some Splunky, and then we'll go into Awesome Knob to close out the night. Now, I don't know how, uh, let me just, uh, I'm not going to be able to see the chat because this one is, again, full screen only. So, sorry if you have anything that you want to suggest to me as I'm building these uh, wacky coasters. Also have to do a monitor capture on this one. Because this was a... Uh, it's actually not that, that old a game. This is a Roller Coaster Factory 2. Oh, that's loud. Maybe it's just loud for me. Let me, uh... I didn't check the volume level. Let me, uh, check that. Room. Yeah, Okay, that is that looks like it might be a little more reasonable. All right. Okay, yeah, that'll do. Do you don't you love the? Uh, it's like a uh, '90s educational video soundtrack, isn't it? And that's also how you can tell a quality program is when it uh, it crashes upon a normal exit. Okay, we should be good now. Sorry, I should have done a volume test beforehand. Okay, so this is a 2002 game, which is two years before Roller Coaster Tycoon 3. So I get, I don't know if you'd call it ahead of the game or not. I mean, graphically, it's okay for its time. It's just... I don't know if you can really call it a game, because games usually have goals, and this is just... It's just building a coaster, that's all it is. So I'm gonna see if I can. Uh, I'm gonna see if I can build one of each type during this uh, this video. So we'll just start things off with the uh, wooden, good old classic. I don't think this uses a. Uh, I don't think this uses different executables like uh, Worms Armageddon does. Okay, so I can't I can't choose specifically where the station is. I just have a choice of like six spots that I can put it in, and I can't even see the spots very well. Like I have no idea where that is relative to everything else. Also, I. <laughs> That's some nice clipping going on into the uh, into the cliff over there. You see that? Gosh, I'm sure. Fuck it. We'll uh, we'll put it in here just so it's uh, we'll put it in here so it's to utterly inaccessible to anyone who wants on the ride. You see that ramp over there? That is not going to be wheelchair friendly. And it's just picking piece by piece by what can fit in the area that you have. It does have full 3D though, which is, uh, I guess, better than uh, Roller Coaster Tycoon just had the isometric four-way. Oh, and I can't build anything now. Okay, what's the, okay, that's the back button. It does have a, a better variety of parts than uh, original Roller Coaster Tycoon did. So I mean, it, it, there is that, it has that going for it. This is 
by uh, value soft. You, you know a uh, you know you got a quality company when the best thing you can advertise is that your products are cheap. Your uh, your games that you make. That's generally the best thing that people want in a in a video game. It's cheap. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Okay, I can't do that. Oh, those are soon gonna be some horizontal trees. Where's the tunnel at? There's a tunnel on this map. Okay, there it is. The scrolling is a little bit slow. Not ideal. Gotta get this just right. Is that it? Okay, that looks like it's spot on. I remember I. I did spend a lot of time fucking around in this when I was younger because I couldn't get Roller Coaster Tycoon 3 to run. And this was the only game I had that I could, you know, ride the coasters. Which was neat at the time. Okay, that's not gonna block off the station. slow on the scroll. Scrolling could be a lot better. I have mixed feelings on the music in this game. It's very generic, it's very stereotypical 90s, and again, it sounds just so much like one of those cheesy educational videos. But it's catchy, it's not terrible. In its own weird way. Yeah, this is- I'm not making this coaster all that exciting. Is that a thing I can do? Oh, I can't. Why can't I build here? What's going on? It's, just, it's totally clear. Well, that sucks. Is it just too high? Okay, can I not build on top of... That, that, that kind of sucks. I can't build tracks like parallel on top of each other. Tracks just can't overlap. Well, that's kind of lame. I do want to get to the other coasters, so I'm not going to spend too, too long on this thing. Oh, God, no, they can't overlap at all. Wow, that sucks. So you got to design these things like, uh, like Snake. Or Centipede, that game. They just don't go over each other. I wonder if this is like, uh, I mean, I don't think this is real time. I don't know if this is real time, like, uh, figuring out whether a track can go there or not, or if, uh, they're, like, pre-programmed 
spots for every kind of track segment, because it is, it's obviously tile-based. You can tell that just because, I mean, everything's 90 degree turns, they don't have a, they don't have a 45 like Roller Coaster Tycoon does. Where am I going? Where's the exit? Exit is down there. I hope I'm not blocked off from that by my own track. Because that would be a lot of backtracking to do. God, the scrolling is so slow. if I could tell if it was going to make it up this or not. Show off some more uh, creative games. I need to get back to uh, like Mod Nation Racers. I still need to do my uh, eventual PS3 stream. It's gonna happen one of these days. I wonder if I can get up, up on top of that. Probably too high. I don't think I can. I could try. Screw it. I'm going back.
Oh, I can. Okay. Okay, too high. Too high for supports. Can't go that high. Let's try this. Maybe this will be high enough. Oh, only if I do this. I can only curve. I can't go straight down. That's not. They're, they're not having that bad. Oh, that's gonna be a. That's gonna be a loopy part. Where am I going? Where's the? Where's the thing? I can't see the thing. Uh, I'm a little off, okay. Hmm. We need more curves! Pass it. There we go. Around the mountain. Just for full hair. Where am I going? Okay, I'm a little far. I, I will actually end this thing now. There we go. Okay, let's test that one. Let's see if that works. We got a nice, big, meaty lift hill right in the middle. Jokes on you, bitches. I found a way to. I found a way to get over the tracks. The tracks are crossed. I still have no idea what that lock-on target thing button does. Unforgiving when there's one spot that just doesn't. I want to do that swirly thing though at the top. That was cool. But how am I gonna do it? Yeah, I can't do anything with this tunnel. I'm gonna have to do it. Uh, I'm gonna have to undo the tunnel. God. This is annoying. I'm annoyed. That's okay. I will I will take these lessons to my future uh, roller coaster designs and they will be better for it. is going to happen. The thing happening will be done. Actually, I can do it at, uh, I'm going to start at the bottom. That's wrong. You also can't, uh, I mean, for obvious reasons, you can't modify the land like you could in, uh, Tycoon. So, uh, you're stuck with what you got. If you want to do something cool, You, you have your limits. Oh, not quite. Okay. Oomph, 
No, we start the hill. Oh, I'm not quite there yet. Okay. I need to go a little bit further. You know, no, I'm not gonna risk that. I've, I've learned. I will not use the big hill, because the big hill may not work. Okay, I can get away with waking one more. Oh, no, I can't. You tricked me, game. This will be a really tedious lift hill. There we go. We got the, the thing happened. We're good with the thing. The thing happening is done. We're back on track. No pun intended. Okay, pun intended. I'll take the blame for that one. Again, for any of you new, anyone coming in now, I cannot, uh, cannot see the chat. So if you're yelling obscenities at me, I have no idea. Because this game does not have a window. And again, hesitating to call it a game because games usually have goals. This does not. This is just a... I, is, this a is this a sim? Does this count? Is this roller coaster builder sim? I want to do or care to do with the land. Not really. Okay, I'll, I'll go and jump that. Uh, I'm gonna jump it. I'm gonna jump that little, uh, nook. I gotta... I don't know if I'm lined up, though. Uh, a little long. Let me put the start of a ramp, but it won't let me continue the ramp after that point. Okay, wait, how high am I? Good question to ask yourself from time to time. I don't think it. And we go through the tunnel and then we're done. Okay, the few change few changes to the design over the course of its uh, happening, but that's okay. That, that, that's what happens with any design. And we just plow on through. Now let's test this. Let's make sure this works. I don't think it will let you ride it unless it's tested first. So this is a necessary step. See, in a game, you would be punished for having two lift numbers because that is inefficient. And it increases the running cost of the ride. But we don't care. We're just here to make cool posters. Now this is a wooden coaster, so it's the simplest one. I think the uh, the steel ones do have special pieces like loops and, sh and such.
can you imagine this roller coaster? It would, this would be a cool coaster in real life, just going up on this uh, probably not very safe or stable building a coaster on a structure like this, but it'd be cool. And broken eggs. I feel like there are some limiters on the uh, on the coaster here. I don't think it would be only be going 70 after a drop like that. I don't think this is the uh, the most realistic coaster standards. Oh, that's not gonna make it up. Shit. Okay, that's not too bad. I can uh, I can work with that. This last part is is pretty simple. Just need more hills. Nope, too low. I was also considering doing a uh, maple story today. It's for nostalgia's sake mostly, but. Uh, I forgot that I uninstalled it, or maybe it's installed on my uh, external. And installing it would be, uh, it would require 10 gigabytes, and it would take 5 hours, so, uh, no maple story tonight. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll do it tomorrow, maybe I'll commit to the end. I mean, I either have to, uh, either have to install it, or, uh, if it's on my external, I just have to stream from a different room. Which is also possible. Which is, uh, less ideal. This was a game from my childhood, though. This and Pokemon Play, and I just had the discs for uh, lying around. And you know, I have weird, I have weird unknown old games like this. I mean, might as well share them. I also have a collection of, uh, I have a collection of other old PC discs that I got at a much later date, when I was little. and I haven't, I haven't actually gotten any of them in the world. but, uh, maybe they're potential streamers. I don't remember what some of them, I, I, I don't remember what some of them are, one of them is like a Sonic Actually, I think that might be a Sonic CD disc, not a, not a PC. One of them... I don't remember the name of it. It's Star something. I know it's not Star Mountain. That's something else. Like a, there's like a Death Race game. There are a few old things. And Whiplash. Again, do not think it would be still down at 70 miles per hour after that kind of drop. And lift hill number three. Are we done yet? You don't. You don't really realize how a team like real life coasters are compared to the stuff you make in these games until you uh, like go and see one in real life. And there are exceptions. There are some extreme coasters, but I, mean, I went to the county fair and it's like uh, the biggest, craziest coaster they've got there at the theme park is uh, it's like the size of one of the little kiddiest, babiest coasters in Roller Coaster Tycoon. Well, you, 
guys remember that? Remember floppy disks? No, I didn't think you did. It's the ride. Okay, I did save it. Just to be sure. Okay, yeah, it's still there. Oh! That's not good. That's not supposed to happen. Oh, it's still loud? Okay, I can, uh... I can turn it down some more. Thank you for the notification, Diz. And one more time! Well, actually, two more times, because I gotta adjust the volume. Hopefully that's a hopefully that's a little bit better. If I uh, open if I minimize and reopen the game, my cursor's stuck. I can't go outside of like a little bounding box. Oh, except okay, unless I'm forceful enough, then it'll work. Okay, I just gotta I just gotta whip it really hard, and then the cursor will fall in line. Okay. That makes sense. I didn't know you could use digital percussive maintenance on anything. Well, shit, that sucks. Let's see if maybe I can load it in the, uh... Maybe I can load it in the actual editor. Maybe that'll work. Oh, I can change the color. The old, the rickety old number seven. There are different cart types. Well, paint jobs. Eyesore. What is it? I wish it would stay in one place so I could see the part that matters, the logo. Yeah, sure, we'll be the eyesore. What were we on? We were on this one. Okay. No? Huh. Okay, so we can't load rides. That kind of sucks. Well, now I wish I'd ridden it. Okay, so we're gonna have to, uh, gonna have to ride the rides before we leave. I wanted to save them for the end of the video, but that's obviously not happening. That sucks. Alright, well, we got to test that one. We get, didn't get to ride on it. Let's, uh, let's go into a steel coaster, I guess. Salamander. Oh, this is a very... Is a very inspired color scheme. Silver bullet. Okay, sure, why not? Whatever. I, I don't care. And we'll do the... Yeah, sure, we'll do the desert this time. So th this is a... Uh, like Pokemon Play It, and like a lot of these kinds of old games, I had to do a lot of work to get this actually working on Windows 7. This was not an easy task, so, uh... Some functionality is bound to be lost. Yeah, sure, this is as good a spot as any. Right on a cliffside where, uh... Where, uh, pedestrians can fall to their inevitable deaths as they attempt to board the death coaster. Oh, I can't do a non chain track. I can't start. Okay, I can't start down. Okay. Whee! And then they do a loop into a brick wall. That'll be fun, right? That sounds like fun. I think the type of 
I think the music that plays is contingent on the uh, coaster you're making. So this is the steel coaster music. What's the level like? I haven't even seen the thing. Where am I going? Look around. Okay. So there's very little in this direction. I guess I'm going this way. Actually, I'm gonna... Aiming for the tunnel. Is there a tunnel? I can't see. There is not a tunnel. That is just a sheer cliff. Okay. I wonder if I can get on top of it. Let's try this. Yeah, that's a cool dip, right? exciting coaster in the world. Nope, sheer wall. That might be a little high to scale. I'm still gonna try it though. No. God damn it. Nope, it cannot make it up. It is just short. Maybe if I'm one later. I I'm still gonna try and make this happen. Nope, just, it just can't do it, just gives up. Okay. That's cool too. I didn't want to get up there anyway. And whiplash. More whiplash! Extra whiplash! Let's do all we can to kill our passengers. How high is that? Okay, that well, should make it. Probably. Hopefully. Maybe. We'll see. God, the scrolling is so slow. Oh, there are multiple tunnels. We're gonna do some double t double penetration, boys and girls. I'm so paranoid about the height now, to be sure it actually makes the grade. Okay, so there's like one piece, two pieces. Okay, so that's the same height as the previous hill. It should be okay, but just in case, maybe I should do a lift hill. Sure, why not? Random loop. Nah, I might not make that. Now a random loop. Nope, too close. Right through the cactus. And how are we gonna get back? We still have one more hole to hold to cover. That was pretty much all I did in this game, was always make sure that I went through every tunnel. I had a very Freudian childhood, some might say.
Oh, I can't do another one? In the opposite direction? That's no fun. Okay, where am I going now? This level has a lot more, uh, a lot more things in it than the previous one. Oh, there is a hole. Okay, is there something that I can do with that? I must fill every hole. There can be no hole unfilled. I'm just, I'm just rolling with the terrain. That's all. That's all I'm doing. Where's this hole? I'm going in the back door. Actually, be uh, it might be too high. That's too high. Okay. I can't see where the hole is though. There we go. Okay, I made it. I I squeezed in. It's probably... I'm probably losing speed at this point. I probably shouldn't do that. It's been a while since I had a lift, lift hill. In fact, I'll probably go back and take care of that. I hate having to... I hate having to worry so much about this. I hate that I can't just pick the part I want to replace, like in Roller Coaster Tycoon. Why, why do you? Why would you go up? There's no where to go to. Don't worry, we will actually get to ride this one. I promise. The game doesn't like that. The game doesn't like the tracks that are going through each other. Even though it suggested that I do it, it will not let me continue because it realizes that it fucked up. guiding me at this point. This game is made for, uh, this game is made for people who like holes. This game is made for Shia LaBeouf. He was the guy, he was in holes, wasn't he? That's the right guy? I don't know about movies. I need Jack here to yell at me when I get something about a movie wrong. Are there any other holes I can fill? I gotta look. God, the scrolling! Scroll faster! I think there's a hole down here. Is there? No, there's not. Did I fill all the holes? So I think that's all the holes. My whole lust will have to uh, have to be satiated. Okay, now I'll just do some uh, snaking. Yeah, 
interested. This one feels so much bigger than the last one. Like this, uh, just this general region. Okay, I think I can make, I think I can get on top of that rock pretty easily. I want to make a lift hill up there. I want to make a big lift hill on this one, too. I'm just figuring out what the best way is to get up there. Because I can't, I still can't cross the tracks. It doesn't like me doing that. Alright, I'm gonna, I'm gonna... I'm gonna twist my way out of this hole. It's a little bit extreme. If you're squeamish, you may want to look away. I have to start a lift hill with a straight line. I can't just... I can't just go straight... I can't just start up, and I can't just, uh... I can't just turn a regular hill into a lift hill like I can in a roller coaster. It doesn't work like that. target. Okay, I can afford to be a little closer even. All the way. Nope, too high. Oh, it's still too high. Really? Okay, it'll let me go on a curve. For some reason, curves can go, uh... It's attached to nothing. It is mounted on the air. That is a levitating, uh... Levitating pillar. Okay. Can I loop around again? Can these pack... Okay, these, these ones are crossing. Maybe it's just the wooden one that can't cross itself. It gets mad if it fucks up still. I, I wanted to do the roller coaster tycoon uh, movement. Okay, maybe I can. Uh, maybe I can do my idea. Maybe the game will work with me. weird. It can't just turn again. It won't let me do that. If it can cross over itself, that'll be uh, convenient. I think this one can actually, uh... I think, I don't remember if it's only you can do it in Roller Coaster Tycoon. I think in this one you can actually, uh, run through the loops that you make. Okay, yeah, it can cross with itself. It just wooden coasters won't let you do that. There we go. 
Okay, I'm satisfied with that. Let's see if this works. Cross your fingers, folks. Now, we've seen that there's no point saving these, so I will not... I'm not going to bother saving this one, but... If it had a name, I think the name would be, uh... Hole Filler. That sounds like a good name for a coaster. You, you'd, you'd ride a coaster named a Hole Filler, wouldn't you? Go to the Six Flags? Arizona? Is there a Six Flags? I don't know if there is a Six Flags in Arizona. There could be, for all I know. Six Flags Phoenix. Six Flags Tucson. I'm just gonna inch along towards the coaster to keep up with it. In a stuttery, stuttery steps. Oh, here's the neck breaker. Again, I have to test before I can ride, so this is unfortunately a necessary step. But we will ride this one. You have my word. Unless it crashes again. In which case, I guess riding just won't work and I have no control over that. Hopefully that doesn't happen. Oh, please make it. Please make it. Please. Okay, good. I... If, it, if I had to go back again, I would... I, I would I would, I would be, I'd be done. It's a good thing I put that extra lift kill in, because it wasn't going to make a second one of those. Oh, yes, we're approaching our first hole. Boop! Oh, no. Oh, no. Please make it. Please make it. Please make it. It's not going to make it. Shit. Well, uh, would be great if I could just like select that loop and get rid of it. I'd enjoy that quite a, a bit. That'd be very nice. That's so far back, and you can't test the con the coaster until it's completed either. So I couldn't, like, build it up to that part, test it to be sure, and then continue building. God, that sucks. I'm gonna do my best to remember it and just blaze through it. I'm gonna try that. Okay, here we go. This is gonna be a speedrun video. Artif Artificial Academy 2 is more of a game than this because that has goals. Okay, no loops, no fun allowed. Oh, god damn it. I mean, most of this is not too hard because it's just following the contours of the land. That was really disappointing, though. Okay, 
I remember them. This is not the one that I tur curved out of. That was the next hole. There's one more hole we have to fill. I see it over there. I remember this was the hole that I was guided to. See, we're, we're already experiencing, like, uh, memories of our past hole fillings. Why I say it, oh, I say it that way, it sounds like we're talking about the dentist. Closer to the hole first. Okay, this is the one that we curved out of. I remember this. way to exit this was with a curve, because anything else was too extreme. Too extreme! How did this part go? I, I remember this. You don't have to tell me, I, I know this. Good, it'll be great. This is totally gonna make this. I mean, all things considered, is a very limited editor with the number of uh, number of landscapes and coaster types you have to work with. I mean, comparatively, it's still, you can still, you know, make a variety of things within the, uh, within the confines of the parts you have available. You can look at the, uh, oh, I can't rotate. You know, like that, uh, liability waiting to happen, that death cliff right next to the entrance? I know I do. Someone's gonna fall off that. I guess I could try to check check chat, but I really don't want to. With the stability that this game has shown, I really don't want to try minimizing it. So 90s educational video. Like this, this is the kind of music I expect to play back, play on the on VHS tapes teaching you like American Sign Language or something. This is 
my favorite part, the loopless straightaway. It's just like driving through the actual desert. Oh, please don't tell me it's gonna run out of speed before it gets there. You motherfucker. That doesn't happen in Roller Coaster Tycoon, it just keeps going! <sighs> I remembered it once, I can remember it again. God, this is inefficient. Fuck it, the whole thing is a lift hill. It'll be even better than the first half of the desert ride. Cool guys, it'll be worth it when it's all done. It's gonna be like the coolest thing ever. It'll be worth all the shekels. So how many times have I built this coaster by now? You also couldn't do a uh, curved lift chains in Roller Coaster Tycoon, I don't think. So hey, that's that's one feature this game has over it. Well, I'm riding the rides, so. I mean, this got to it two years before Roller Coaster Tycoon did. I still, I still need to get the newest, like the new, new Roller Coaster Tycoon game. Although the last things I heard about it were negative, and since then no one's talked about it. So I'm guessing it was uh, forgotten about quickly. There's that other one, uh, uh, Ro Roller Coaster World or something. There was some other roller coaster tycoon, not not tycoon, or another roller coaster game that's supposed to be like the new roller coaster tycoon, but does everything better. We're saying. So that'll be something. To look into. At least we have this sweet music to keep us company. Last one will not be nearly this complicated. I'll do a little. I'll do a little shitty one for the third coaster. I just wanted to have one long, cool one 
to actually ride in this video. Since we didn't get to ride the wooden one. I'll just... I don't... I don't even care about... Uh, I don't even care about trying to do the scrolling thing. I'll just... I'll just watch from here. Go... Go have your fun in the desert road, Arizona coaster. Okay, it's on the lift. We are secure. Now you better make it to that fucking exit. second hole penetration is slow. It's going to creep in there. It's not going to be very forceful. It's going to just kind of, it's going to ease its way. It's going to be gentle. It's going to come up at a slight angle to ease entry. Just going to very slowly, very safely pass through. The hole has been penetrated. Is this a lift hill? This isn't a lift hill. It bet please, but it's gonna run out of juice. It's gonna run out of momentum. Motherfucker. He doesn't even have enough to make it up there. I should just test these parts and get to the end exit as quickly as possible so I don't have to keep rebuilding. be a little more exciting now. Yeah, screw it. That doesn't even break. Okay, now there's no way it can't make this. But I'm really fucking paranoid now. Coaster just gonna be fucking lift hills. Okay. We're, it cannot, it can't fail now. Like, it's just got, it's got too many lift hills to fail. Too much lift to fail. out of juice at the very end, it's not as bad. I don't have to rebuild nearly as much. It'll just, we'll just have to watch the whole thing again. Which will suck, but... Come on, baby! Then you need a pee break, now's the time.
fact, I'm gonna get a yogurt. I'm gonna take this opportunity. back with yogurt. I have my, uh, my yolk crunch. It's like uh, vanilla with little uh, Snickers. Mixed in. Did I miss anything? Oh wow, look how far it is! Oh, it actually, okay, it actually made it to the big lift hill. That's good. I think. Is that where it's at? I can't tell. Oh no, it's... <laughs> It's still back there. I really did not miss much. It's okay though, I'm not wearing my headset, so you don't need to hear me chew. The most ludicrously unnecessary lift hill. even lift bro. It had to be said at some point. Okay, and then it makes it, it's got a little, little more downward momentum. It's got a little, little help. So it can reach the next stretch of lift hill. Oh, and it just slows down as soon as it hits. It doesn't even, uh, it doesn't even keep coasting at speed like it does in Roller Coaster Tycoon. I guess this also rotates. Got a little more limited uh, control. Observe as the wild roller coaster emerges from its natural habitat in holes. Not caves, holes. They're, they're very, very different habitat.
Hey, it made it. This roller coaster can take one little tiny drop before it needs another fucking lift hill. I don't know if the, how physics based this is. If it uh, if it would have more mass and maybe go farther if it had more carts, but I don't think I can control the number of carts. I think for the test purposes, you need to use the minimum to be sure that you know the lightest, weakest cart can still make it through the track. We're on the home stretch. It's going to make it. Maybe. Hopefully. If it doesn't lose too much speed around the curves. We're coming up on the part. Oh, 30. It's not going to make it. Shit. I called it. I knew exactly where it was going to happen. Seriously, guys, I am sorry for my own inadequacy. Okay, this is the final one. For realsies, we know this one. Just another lift hill. All the lifts. not roller coaster factory too this is a lift hill factory too I actually don't know what the story is between behind roller coaster factory one or where that ever was maybe that was like a browser or a uh, like a shockwave game because there's like it's not there's no record of it anyway there anywhere there's barely record of this game like you're not gonna find this on Wikipedia or anything but you can, uh, if you Google it, I think there are some, like, really old game retailers that still have an entry for Roller Coaster Factory 2. Not one! Maybe one never existed. Maybe they just called it 2 to, like, play on, play on the idea that, uh, maybe they were trying to use sequel power without ever having an original to do a sequel of. Maybe this was released in the same year as Roller Coaster Tycoon 2, and they just thought, whatever, as long as it has two in it, we can compete. I, I have no idea. Good luck finding Roller Coaster Factory 1, though. If anyone takes upon that task, Godspeed. This is a sequel without a prequel. Much as some might argue the Star Wars series should be. We're the most exciting part of the ride. Let's watch. And I only use like I only use like 20% of this landscape too. Can you imagine if I went out of my way to fill up as much of this as possible? Like just using as many lift hills as I needed to cover as much of the area with track as I could. And because this is a steel coaster, it can overlap with itself too, not like the wooden coaster where it's just uh, like snake or centipede can't roll your own tail. It would be an insanely long track. If I'd be here all night, even without testing the thing. And then with testing the thing would take a week. If this coaster is any indication.
got the momentum you need to clear a loop-de-loop -loop in this game. Like, there's no point even attempting it. This coaster loses momentum so fast that you have to use, like, you have to get on top of one of these sheer cliff rocks or something. Get as high as the lift hill can possibly get in the game. Go all the way to the bottom, do one loop, and then you're done. You need another lift hill to continue. Just the momentum loss in this game compared to Roller Coaster Tycoon is insane. They did they completely missed the coaster part of roller coaster. I guess it's realistic in that, uh, you know, roller coasters lose momentum faster than, I, than, than they do in Roller Coaster Tycoon, but, uh, you know, the whole point of this game is not to be realistic. That's the whole fun of building these crazy coasters. And then you get to ride them, you get to ride, quote unquote, ride coasters that you wouldn't get to in real life. I wonder if maybe Roller Coaster Factory 1 was, uh, maybe that was like an arcade cabinet. Or something that was exclusively sold to businesses. Because I remember they used to have a, there was a, like a Bullwinkle's parlor in this area. Or in the, you know, Southwest Washington, Northwest Oregon area. I don't remember where it's at specifically. But they had an attraction that was a, uh, you know, one of those things that was an enclosed, like, seated room, and it was on an arm, and it would rock around and, like, simulate movement. Okay, they, they, a lot of them are, like, fairs for, like, spaceship simulators and things. But this one was a roller coaster one. And it would rock around and, and jump and pro uh, provide G's and everything to make it feel like you're on a virtual roller coaster. And they had a program out front that you could, you know, design your coaster before getting on the ride, if you wanted to. So, I don't know, for all I know, maybe that was Roller Coaster Factory 1. From what little I remember of it, it was kind of like this, the designer. Another unnecessary lift hill to finish things off. Better not run out of speed before you get there. Silence. It was going straight. And it couldn't even make it. I'd like to spelunk tonight. I'd like that to happen. Now, this is just a podcast. I just have to think, to think of more shit to talk about. While this thing is going through the motions that it's already gone through this many times. It'll be worth it, though, guys, for real. When we actually ride the thing, it's gonna be so awesome. I think there was a, uh... I think it was on Tosh.0, like, a while ago, when the show was first starting out, there was a video of, of a couple of old ladies on YouTube. Like, putting on a cheesy... cheesy fake roller coaster excitement act with footage from this game playing in the background like they were writing it. And I think that was the most exposure this game has ever gotten. 
I think it was this game. I'm not positive. Might have been Roller Coaster Tycoon 3. Or some other game. I'm sure there are others like this that I've just never heard about. I have no idea where I got this game. I have no idea where it came from. My parents must have bought it for me at some point when I was younger. Meaning at some point this was in fact sold in retail stores. Like, uh, you like Roller Coaster Tycoon? You like building roller coasters? Well, now why, why not have a you know a game that's just about that and nothing else? You don't need the scenarios. You don't need the goals. You don't need other rides or music. You don't need you don't need guests with shitty shitty AI. And you don't need goals to be just just build roller coasters. That's what people buy the game for. You man, just make a whole game out of that. Well, game quote unquote. It's like the. Uh, it's like the roller coaster editor feature in Roller Coaster Tycoon 2. And nothing else. That's just the whole game. And I can't think of any time you would use the editor feature in Roller Coaster Tycoon 2. Because there was no reason to use it other than to. I mean, you, you could use it to build rides without financial limitations, and then you could save the designs, but. I mean, most of the time I built, I built rides around the landscape, so. There wasn't a whole lot of point building a coaster that, you know, required flat land or whatever it was. There was just too much variance in the scenarios for that to be practical. The scenario editor, however, was a cool feature. I appreciated that. I used that a lot when I was younger. And speaking of Roller Coaster Tycoon 2, I do want to try Open Roller Coaster Tycoon again. See if we can get that working between uh, me and Bacon Bomb and Jack. But that's still in the air because uh, last time Jack was having some difficulties with it. I mean, me and Bacon were able to play it just fine, so I guess I could just do I could do a video with just the two of us if we wanted to. But uh, hey, it'd be more fun with three people if we can. We'll have to do some uh, some testing to see if we can get it working with Jack. Also got to try and get sound banks working with Dirt Mega and Worms. There's a lot of troubleshooting that goes into these streams. And again, this game took uh, quite a while to get working on this Windows 7 computer. It's another one that I wanted to do before I got a new computer, which isn't going to be any time too, too soon, given that I have no money at the moment, but, uh, you know, it's something that happened in the next year, probably. My, uh, the headset, the headphone port on this one is starting to, starting to act up. It's being inconsistent. So, uh, and of course there are other problems with it, with it too. I'm not going to get a whole new computer. Just, okay, I probably would get a whole new computer because of the headphone port, because I use that a lot. But, I mean, it's still technically working, so until it just goes kaput, I'm not in any real emergency, but... And I would be able to get a Windows 7 computer. There's this awesome shop over here in Battleground that sells them. And they edit the registry so that it does not pop up with any of that Windows 10 nonsense. That, like, none of that ever appears on the computer. No hide or hair. So if I got a new computer, it would probably still be Windows 7, but... I would just have to set up all of these, do all of whatever setup I had to do to get this working on it again on the new computer, and I don't remember what that setup was, so it would just have to be, I'd be going through all this shit again, just a mess of troubleshooting. Artificial Academy 2, that's why I wanted to get that video done, or at least one of them was because that is a bitch and a half to get set up on a computer. There are all sorts of variables on tr just trying to get it running. And it doesn't run at all on Windows 10, from what I've heard. There's no workaround for that yet, so... Sorry if you have Windows 10 or are interested in playing Artificial Academy after our fabulous videos. 
hopefully are planning another one in the nearest future, by the way. That and so there's other, uh, there's some other After Dark content planned. Wasn't expecting to make a series out of, a series out of that. Hey, we're almost done, guys. It's gonna be, the video's gonna end. Isn't that nice? Again, I can't read the chat, so I just I just keep bringing this up just in case there are new people coming in. Because this game is full screen only, does not support Windows. So if you're screaming at me that it's still too loud or now it's too quiet, I have no way of knowing this. Okay, and then it makes it to the chain. Okay, we're good. Just cruising back into the uh, cruising back into the station, the suicide station. Or the uh, liability waiver station. Really, they could at least install a handrail or something along that cliff. That's what, a 20 foot drop? Nah, I'm sure it's fine. Okay. You guys ready? We can ride the thing now! And now, are you ready to watch it crash? Three, two, one. Oh, it worked. Can I look around? No. Okay, I just I'm forced to look ahead. I have no neck while uh, I have no neck while riding my own coaster, which I guess is beneficial because that means if I had a neck, it would just break anyway. So you can't get rid of the UI though, so you still have to. Oh boy, another lift hill! This is the best ride ever! You just have to put up with the HUD the, the being there the whole time. Oh, what do you mean I can't build any parts here? I, I wanted to I wanted to put like some uh, like a photo section on the ride. I wanted to put some like some sweet smiley face decals, maybe some dicks or something. Can I spray paint the ride as I go along? Can I make these handrails red? No? Okay. Can't really decide. You can't really change the color of your track either. You just have the presets for whatever type of coaster you're building. Value Soft. When you don't need the best games, only the cheapest games. And Whiplash. 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 You like that juicy frame right there? I guess considering the computers that this game was made to run on, I mean, it, it runs pretty smoothly. It's got pretty nice 3D for its time. It's a lot more optimized than uh, Roller Coaster Tycoon 3 was. Which, again, like back in the day, I could never get it working on my computer. It was always running at two frames a second because it was just too resource resource intensive. I haven't tried it since. I have it on Steam. I need to give it a shot. Wow, it feels like I'm driving through Arizona. Right at the cactus. Now it feels like I'm driving slowly through Arizona. Up on, on the second hole, hole number two. It's a little more sensitive than the first hole. You need, need to approach it gently. Easy, easy does it. And slowly, carefully, tactfully. I'm going to approach it at a bit of an angle. I'm going to rise into it for an easier entry. Appropriately, appropriately lubricated. And beautiful. Beautiful ten point entry. Ah, that's the light on the other side. Simply the cat's meow. By the way, I lied. I, I said earlier that this uh, 
if it, if we were saving this coaster, it would be called like Hole Filler or something. It, it it's called Lift Hill. It's the Lift Hill coaster. It's Lift Hill Factory Two. Do you even lift, bro? That's the that's the subtitle. Oh, the lift hill's over. That was my favorite part. Ah, whiplash. Oh, that's a that's a faster hole entry. And a little twisted. It's okay, I like it that way. And desert. No, we're going too fast. We're breaking the speed limit. We gotta bring it down. I wonder how accurate these speed limits are. Because, like, looking at this, I'm not sure if it's quite 6 miles per hour. Maybe it's a little faster. Tease it. Tease it. Oh, another perfect slow entry. Oh, it's clipping into the walls there. We don't have enough room for the handrails. There will be no way to safely walk through this, this, uh, this tunnel. This hole on the right side. And that left side clips through as well. We're gonna twist our way out of this one. We're gonna inch along on more lift hill. Again, the most exciting part of any roller coaster. And the most exciting part is over. Now we gotta go through the boring uh, drop part at like 30 miles an hour. Who wants that? Who wants to go fast on a roller coaster? Nobody, right? I mean, it, the, the points on a roller coaster you're going fast are really just, they're just interim. You're just, they're just waiting for the, for the coaster to slow down so that you can go slow again. That's the most satisfying part about being on a coaster is when it goes slow. That's why, you know, the, the momentum loss is an important part of this game that gives an edge over its competitors. Okay, this is the big one. Can't really tell because all you can see is brown dust desert sky. Yeah, it's not even much of a set. For the tallest lift hill on the course, that's not even a satisfying drop. It doesn't get to go all the way down. Nice, pretty, dusty, nothing landscape, though. This game is like a, uh, this is just like a, a, a billionaire's pet project, is this game. Like, he's not, ex he's not building a, a coast, a coaster out here for, like, people to ride. This is not where a theme park's gonna be, this is just, it's just as random as Basin in the Desert. He's just building whatever the hell kind of coaster he wants, it's gonna be, uh, it's just gonna be for him. He's just gonna, he's gonna airlift himself here because there's no entry, there's no pass, there's no entryway to get in by, by car or anything. He's gonna airlift his way into this random-ass barren desert. And maybe once every two or three years he's gonna remember he has this coaster sitting out here and go for, go for a joyride on a lift hill coaster. Okay, top speed 60. That's kind of a shitty top speed. That's okay though. You don't want to. You don't want speed on a roller coaster. That it's 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 uh, it's superficial. It's un it's it's that it's unnecessary. Okay. Turn the main menu. No, we don't need to save it. And we all know the save doesn't work. Now I'm gonna do a really dinky one. I'm gonna do a really fast, really dinky one because I, I want to move on to Splunky. We'll, let, we'll do the we'll do the Ice World. We haven't done that yet. I'm just gonna see if I can find the biggest, uh, biggest thing to make a lift off of. Oh god, that's a lot of. There are a lot of trees here. That that's hard to work around. Okay, that one looks cool. I like that one. Okay, what's the tallest object? 
nothing. There are no tall objects on this course. Okay. Hmm. Well, this isn't gonna be that fun then, but... I guess I'll do my best. Oh, this is some funky music. I want to have at least one good drop on this one. Again, going to be very short. I'm not going to spend a lot of time on this after that travesty of a coaster last time. Oh, really? I can't just go straight off there? This is dumb. Okay. Th this will do. I know what I'm doing now. No? I can't... I can't straighten out. It won't let me go flat. No? Wow, this game is awkward when it comes to, uh... When it comes to, like, offset edges like that. And I can't turn... God! This is a very unforgiving terrain. This terrain is not uh, cooperative. Okay, I'll just... I'll go here then, okay? How's that, game? I think this is the highest I can get. I just want to get one high lift hill, and that's it. And straight down. Nope, too high. Shit. Okay, I'll just go straight down the other way, then. Or maybe... Nope. This game doesn't let me have any fun. Can't go down this way. Okay, where am I going? Where's the egg? Where's the end? End is behind me. Okay. way. There, that'll do. No, that's not going to connect. That'll be fine. I'm not going to go ramming into the track. Myself. I want to hit myself. No. Is it, will it at least clear that? I can't tell. It'll probably clear it. We'll be fine. There's the exit. Okay. Just to be safe. Alright, that's it. That's all this one's going to be. Do a shorty, quickie inverted coaster, and then we're gonna move on to Splunky. God, I can't believe we got almost two hours out of this. Not intentional. 
the game stalled for more than its fair share of time. And the one big lift hill. So how are you guys? Not that I can see responses, but I hope you're doing well. I hope no one was scared away by my penetrative jokes in the previous track. This one's just, uh, this coaster's just cold. Lots of trees. Not a whole lot of jokes I can make about it. This was kind of an unimpressive final, uh, locale, though. I was hoping it would have, like, one big, tall spire that I could do it, uh, up on top of, but not on this one, just big, empty, barren tundra with trees. This is the Palin poster. Oh. Oh, okay, it can, it'll let me put a piece there, but it will, like, register that it comes in contact with itself and it'll get mad at me for that, even though it let me put that piece there. probably gonna hit too. Oh yeah, that will. God damn it. If you're not gonna like it, then don't let me put the piece there. Okay, whatever. I'm just gonna... I got to go all the way down. That's fine. I, I don't care. I don't care that much. What is this? Why can I not just turn right? Is that in line? I can't tell. No, it's not. I don't think. I don't think it's in line. Maybe it's at the right height. Yeah, it is. Okay. Gotta wait for the lift hill one more time. At least there's only one on this one. We got more uh, funky fresh music. Keep us occupied. I really would see. This is a game that would benefit from. Uh, I forget what the name of the feature is. Whatever that fast forward thing on the emulator programs is. Like, I don't care about watching it in real time. If I could just, like, fast forward through this to be sure that it'll clear the track, that'd be fine with me. I'll leave the surprise for when I ride the thing. Really, it doesn't even need to, like, watch the thing go through. It could just, like, run all the calculations as if it had gone through and say, okay, this coaster will or will not clear the clear all the tests. This game needs a quick test feature. Now, the cars don't even swing like they do in Roller Coaster Tycoon. They're just static. Okay, they swing if the... They swing if the track swings, but that's it. Okay, see, that was, that was a nice, clear one. That's probably about the length of a realistic roller coaster, too. A real one probably wouldn't have that huge drop in it, but... You know, about the same length. I don't know about you guys, but my nipples are hard. It's like I'm actually there. I can feel I can feel my feet getting frostbitten now. These graphics are just so real. I knock them, but again, they are good for their time.
there are modern games released with graphics like this that my PC can't run, so... They did something right with optimization. I feel like a person with long legs could fairly easily, like, get their legs caught in these rungs underneath the tracks. Like, Slenderman's gonna get his foot caught and lose it. Or there's gonna be some kid with a fake limb who, like, sticks it between them and it's just stuck there for the next person to take. Nope, no swinging needed. Oh, there we go. There's some, there's some motion. There, that, that, that was a course. Oh, hey, this uh, this coaster actually has a coastervideos.com. What is that? Can people, can people upload their recordings of of this game? Is that a thing? I'll I'll have to check that out later. Okay, well that's it. We built one of each. We didn't get to ride the wooden one, but that's because the game is a broken mess. That was Roller Coaster Factory 2. And, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed it more than I did. I'll be right back with some Spelunky. We'll probably do half an hour of that. And then we'll go in some Awesome Knots to finish off the night. So I'll be, be right back. See you in just a bit. Just a minute.